Okay, 99 Fort Ranger and uh, they told me to come by to adjust the TPS. He got a trouble coat and the TPS about too high voltage and when I come here nothing related with that all I got is a O2 sensor bank one not switching running lean so you can see you got the EGR tube there idle air control valve is new mass air flow sensor is new the bank one O2 sensor is new Now I put in a fuel pressure gauge. And I'm gonna cycle the, the ignition. I'm gonna cycle the ignition again. Let me take some air out of here. All I got is 30 pounds. If I remember correctly, let me see my cell. Picture and the fuel pressure on this car. Key on, engine running. Should be 47 to 63. And uh, I think key on engine off is like 35 to 45 but look at this guys this is our pr problem right here it wasn't 30 pound this thing this thing got a, a open injector is losing pressure this car is a half also a fuel pressure regulator right here is no way I can crunch that line and uh, see if that is losing my pressure right here or is the pump itself that is losing the pressure so Definitely that is our problem here. This car is uh, dumping fuel, so the... Look at the pressure losing there. Look at the pressure, guys. Almost in five pounds since I, uh, you know, getting my scanner going. So... I believe it's the 24, but let's uh, make sure. So this car being around, and they changed mass air flow, air idle control valve, the pipe for the EGR. I think the EGR himself being changed. Um, spark plugs, uh, wires, O2 sensors, 
and the car still with the same problem when I come by uh, he tell me he got only one coat and that coat uh, wasn't the one that I find in the car and because they disconnect the battery let's go to scanner uh, continuous memory coat and we got 1131 heater O2 sensor bank 1 sensor 1 and decays lean okay and you can see the fuel gauge is dumping fuel to the so his uh, computer is leaning out the system because you see too much fuel now back out of here and back out of here and we're gonna data display and let's say uh, fuel a vehicle is not supported this few uh, pits let's see that was the message I got before okay I don't think I get this guy going. engine was running look at the fuel gauge going down guys all right short uh, fuel trim 40 One percentage, a hundred percent. Let me save this data. Exit out of here. Auto sensor. Let's go. DPS count low. On 
Peter. Oh, Peter foul. So that is no, that is uh, it's okay, peace, pit. If you say yes, then we got a heater problem. And in the sensor one, O2 sensor, bank one, sensor one. So that is okay. So let's check this guy out here. Check this guy out here. Look at this, I got this car at 3,300 RPMs. Now, I'm gonna leave it in idle to see if this sensor switch and look at the, the rough idle in this car. And the sensor there, look at that. It's dumping fuel in this car here like crazy. I want to see that gauge when I disconnect the... When I disconnect the vacuum and the... To see if the pressure go up. Then we got an injector problem here or something. <clears throat> See if we got a chance. That's my pressure here. Watch the fuel pressure regulator. I disconnected. This is the vacuum source. I don't see no changes there, guys. I don't see no changes there. And uh, it's 40, 44 pounds of pressure there. That's 44 uh, pound of pressure. And the spec for this guy is key on engine running Ranger is supposed to be 47 to 63. Now I'm gonna punch the pedal. You see that? See the needle, the needle is going down and it's supposed to be the opposite. The needle should go up because it's uh, no vacuum and the fuel pressure regulator, but it's a question mark about that fuel pressure regulator right now because I disconnected and nothing happened. So the pressure going down, that is not normal. All right, guys, so I'm gonna tell this guy you gotta start with that fuel pressure regulator <coughs> and go from there to do a test again. Thank you for watching. Again, guys, look at that fuel pressure dropping. Like it's an open injector. A bad fuel uh, pressure regulator. A bad check valve in the pump. And the fuel pump is a check valve also. So, further diagnostic required with this thing. I know now the car, this problem this car have is fuel pressure regulate uh, related so I'm gonna tell the guy this is what we gotta you know troubleshoot now alright guys 
and again I say before thank you for watching but uh, I just want to show you that this is not normal uh, right away that you shut the engine that that needle goes down is uh, is a problem in the fuel system okay guys again thank you for watching